guys, Natasha here. So today I did the infamous pom pom look for you. So if you want to see how I achieved this look, then just keep on watching. So here I'm just spraying um, my Cura Soda Hair Milk Refresher Spray. Instead of using water all the time, sometimes I like to substitute um, water for my Cura Soda Hair Milk Spray instead. So here I'm just parting my hair down the middle um, so I can have a puff on each side. You want to make your part as straight as possible because I mean it is the center of attention for this hairstyle. So try and get it as straight as you possibly can. So here I'm just going to pin one side of my hair up with a hair clip so that that hair is out of the way while I work on the opposite side. So here I'm applying my Kara Sora Hair Milk Styling Butter. Um, I know it says styling butter, but I like to use it as a great moisturizer because Kara Sora products are very moisturizing. So now I'm going to start the detangling process. Um, this allows for the hair to be as smooth as possible when you're trying to lay it down. And you want to make sure you start from your ends and you work your way up to the roots. Your hair is the f most fragile when it's wet. So therefore be very gentle with your hair while you're detangling. And as you can see, I section my hair off while detangling. It just makes the detangling process easier and quicker for me. So here I'm just shaping the sides of my hair so that I can prepare to lay down my edges. This is the Curls Blueberry Bliss Curl Control Paste. It lays down my edges perfectly in this style. To assist laying down my edges, I use a bristle brush. Um, this bristle brush really gets my edges nice and laid and on fleek. So here I'm just getting a hair tie to tie up this side of my hair. Um, you want to at least wrap the hair tie around twice and then the third time you don't pull the hair all the way through. Instead you leave a little bit of the hair out of the tie and the extra hair you just wrap it around the puff and then you stuff the rest into the tie as you can see here. Now I'm going to repeat the process on this side of my head.
going to take a silk scarf and wrap around the edges of my hair this helps prevent breakage and it also helps lay your edges down at night now you're going to put a bonnet on top of your head and this helps to protect the puffs at night now I'm going to take my bonnet off as well as my silk headscarf. Now I like to take my bristle brush and kind of define my baby hairs just a little bit more for this hairstyle. And this is the ending look. I hope you guys like this tutorial. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.